Do we take it out? Oh, you know we do. Right, so he's going to tear me up, but let's do it. Hey guys, it's me, the Cornish Ratbeard, bringing you another video of Seven Days to Die. We're continuing with our playthrough. We're on day eight, the next day after our seventh day horde. Now, there are a few things I want to talk about that because when I finished the video yesterday, I I assumed that was it, okay? That was that was Horde Night done and dusted. Well, no, it wasn't the case. So I actually logged out after I was recording. And when I logged back in just to do a few bits, I had another Horde. So I'm not sure if logging out and logging back in caused the Horde to turn up, but one did turn up and it was a pretty big one. I didn't have any spikes. I didn't have the means to record either, but I didn't have any spikes down below. So they started smashing my base up while I was frantically shooting them anyway. So I then, you'll notice that these are upside down now, right? Well, the story goes and I've got no roof. I then chucked a firebomb down there, Molotov cocktail, and it didn't go off. I mean, it, well, it did, but it went, it didn't go through the gap. It went off in my base and burnt me. Um, so I tried again and it burnt me again. I didn't know why it was doing that or what was happening. Uh, so I tried a rock. Um, just put a rock on my toolbar there and tried that. And it ended up on top of my bars here. So it was like somehow getting caught up there. Um, so I had to take the roof off and then turn these upside down for it to work again. So now it, it shoots through, which is good. But, you know, upside down, whatever. They look just as good, I think. It's cool. And I will make this base one more wooden bars higher and then do the roof again so hopefully that won't do that so what do we, anyway so that was that um what do we have in store for today well i think we're going to go up and do this buried supplies and then we're going to do the cracker book or the gun shop but i think we're going to do the cracker book see if we can find some more recipes that would be pretty awesome i am pretty low on food so if we see any animals out and about i will be grabbing those Let's get on our bike and let's get going over to the buried supplies area. It is that way. Let's reverse up. There we go. Yeah, we didn't do too bad with the horde night. It was pretty easy, if, if I'm honest. That second horde was quite frightening, though. Um, and birds, actually. Birds turned up as well. The, the dead birds. I wish I was able to record it because it was quite good, actually. It did do a bit of damage more than what I thought. Uh, but yeah, it was it was easy other than that. What do we have up there? Is that a crawler? Yeah, I was hoping it was going to be a chicken or a rabbit or something. Is it? Or well, it is, isn't it? It's a chicken. They're pretty tough to get. I wonder if I can just run after it and beat it. Let me try. Where are you, chicken? Ah, oh, there he is. Ah, ha, ha, yes. That's what you get, chicken. That is what you get. Try and hide from me. You can run, but you can't hide. Anyway, that's a bit of meat that we so dearly need. I'm going to carry on and make my way to the dig site. So I'll meet you guys there. So here we are, guys, at the dig site. You know the drill. Let's get the music going. Let's get to work.
Right, all done. We've found the treasure and we're back at the trader. Let's see what he has to offer us. More Magnum ammo. I think so. We might as well just keep getting the good stuff. Why not? Okay, do you have any other jobs? We've got lots of tier 2s now, so that's really good. We can do a fetch and clear. Hmm. Fetch clear there. Yeah, let's do the fetch and clear one. Is there anything here that you might like? Okay, that's good. We'll keep that. And sell you that. Um, that's pretty much it for a minute. Do you have anything that's... Well, we got that gyrocopter there, haven't we? Which we're never going to get in a million years. Um, no. Right, I'm going to pop back to the base and I'm going to get some food and we're going to go in and hit up. Probably still that cracker book. It's going to be a cracker book type of day, I think, guys. Get some schematics. Right, so here we are approaching the cracker book. Let's park the bike outside here so we can use it as another form of storage. Just like that. Um, is there anything I want to put in there now? Mm, no, I'm all right for a minute. But I think I put my blunderbuss there. And if we need be, we're... No, actually, I'm going to play it safe. I'm going to put the blunderbuss there. And let's make sure everything's loaded up. Because you never know what's going to meet us in this place. Alright, let's just swap some of this stuff around. And let's start. I guess this is the way in where the car accidentally smashed its way through the window. We can just search all these books. Um, let's grab the paper. We have a slot for paper. But maybe we are going to want to wake up all the zombies. Let's just sneak about a minute. Have a look and see what's around here. Found to be something dodgy. As quietly as she goes, let's pop around this way. Oh, what was that? I was going to go down into like a cellar or something then. Oh, here we go. What's this? Shotgun. All right. Schematic. Brilliant. Let's read that. We're going to want those for our base. That was a good find. I was quite happy with that. Just in this pile of rubble here. Okay, we've got Cable Guys Never Made It Challenge. Strange note I found while looting. Okay. We'll take that. We'll look at that in a, in a bit. We have still got that other one to get, actually. Is that... I think that's just a corpse, isn't it? Yeah, it's not actually a... A walking, talking zombie. Uh, padded hood. Don't really want that. Alright, so there's a crawler. We've got a crawler. Let's see if we can get him from up here. No, we can't. But he's swiping for me. He's climbing it. What are you doing? Are you going to climb up there? These things freak me out. I think he, he actually hit me from there, look. Take that. Yeah, that's what you get. Very glitching through to me like that. Right, okay, so let's start some of these shelves. Okay, we've read that, so we'll take it for the trader. Alright, there's one there. We're going to wake him up now. If we can wake them all up, we get them outside. The robotic sledge schematic. Nice. All right, come on in, guys. Follow me. Yeah, you're a jumper, aren't you? We can take her out. Let's take her out. While well, she's on her own. Yeah, she's dealt with. Nice. Let's let's carry on where we were, or else we're gonna gonna kind of like get lost on where we were looting. They okay, were there. Oh, nice. A wooden bow. I'll probably uh, get one of those sorted. Doing quite well out of these rubbles, these piles of books. I like that they disappear afterwards because it, you know, it shows that we're done. I can hear a zombie. Just can't see the zombie. There it is. Okay, we can take him. There we go. We took him. All right, his head clean off. Well, I can hear more. 
I think they're just walking around outside. I think I might have woke a few of them out out there. Woke them up. Any more down here? Right, okay, it's banging on the walls on the outside. How much are you worth? Eight bucks, you can stay where you are. What is this, a charity shop? Okay. Keep looking. Oh, that was a good find, wasn't it? 110 dukes in there. Right, did we look at them? Yeah, we did. There's one here that's untouched. I'm just like frightened that they're going to fall from the sky or something because they do that quite a lot and it scares the bejesus out of me. But, but okay, that sounds like whoever that is is getting closer, right? Gonna have to go and take care of her in a minute. Let's just keep trying to get what we can. Okay, we sell that. 160. Making some green there. Making some green. Yeah, have you. All that paper. I don't want to go in my inventory. Ah, let's check that one. Okay. Let's get this done. Ah, right, it's Bob the Builder. Okay. I've got a surprise for you. <laughs> Look at that. It's gone. Right, where were we? Seems a bit quieter, but... Oh, I know there's more. There's always more. When you think you're done, you're not. Remember that. Whoa, see? What was that? Like, things just collapsing and it shouldn't even really collapse. I don't even know why that collapsed, but... It just scares you. Okay, we've got that again. That's good. We'll just sell it. But there's a dude there. But he looks like he's in the spotlight for the next play. I'll see if I can make it to your play, buddy. Just stay where you are. Don't move. Was well, a hands free, is it? <laughs> oh, what was that? Wasteland Treasure Volume 3 adds a chance to harvest acid from cars. Okay. Well, look at that. We're a genius. Quickly read the book and boom. Oh, there's a cracker book book there. Let's just have another look over here. Do we do all these? I like to make sure I get everywhere, you know? Everywhere I can. Okay, oh, I've already done that one there. Bound to be some more zombies around here. Have a look around. Oh, we haven't got that one. That's good. We might as well read it then. There we go. Moving on. There's lots of these piles on the floor. There we go. Look, we're doing well with these. 9mm weapons degrade 20% slower. That's pretty good. Oh, there's a big pile there. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. They're falling from the sky. It's raining zombies. Hallelujah. It's raining zombies. Hey, hey, hey. Right, let's take them outside, shall we? I think we better play it safe, right? Come on, follow me. Let the breadcrumbs are down for you. There we go. Come on, little birdies. Come on, come on. Out we go. Just watch the bike. I've just had a new paint job, all right? So let's get this on. Starting out with the sledge. Boom. That's you down and out. It pays off when you uh, can get them down in one shot because you get your stanima back, don't you? Remember, we got that 20% boost to the stanima if we kill him. Oh, she didn't like that. Right. What about you? Nope. Yeah. I like popping heads, baby. Oh, three out of three. Love it. And we did get a bit of stamina back for that. So how are we doing our inventory space? Quite well. I could read that one as well, couldn't I? I didn't notice that. Okay. Quietly moving on. Let's carry on. 
look here. Right, let's get into this bad boy. It's winking at me. It says look, a crowbar there, look. How about an axe? We're getting it like that. Anything? Yes. 20% greater chance of knocking down the target with sneak attacks with arrows. Okay. Um, yeah, all right, let's take that plastic. Um, let's carry on over this way. Do we think that's all of the zombies, though? I don't know. No. Oh, hello. He's sneaking up on me like that, and we got a cooler as well. Come on. Get out of it. Down you go. I think you... I hate you. You deserve a big smack. Boom! Right, let's just look around the corners first. Okay, we're good. Let's loot, loot, loot. Paper for days. What's well, going to make our um? What's it going to make? It makes these guys the blunderbuss ammo and shotgun gels. I think. You know, I'm not. I I don't trust this floor. I'm gonna do it anyway. Nice baseball bat. Gotta make one of they, haven't we? What's that? Not sure, but some ammo here. Oh, nice. A little mod. Reload 15% faster. That's going to be pretty decent, you know. Whoa. What? <laughs> Mate, are you drunk? Slept in there for the night, did you? Oh. You in. This is a cracker book. This is, that was a kid's area. And you were drunk. What were you, the bad Santa? Yeah. Thought so. Right, where was we? They're popping out of everywhere, aren't they? But we're doing well, actually. You know? I'm not dead yet, right? So... And I'm getting stuff I haven't had before. Right, you can fall up to 15 meters without taking damage while carrying 5,000 dukes or more. Oh, okay, so... You know, the deal there is you've got to have some dukes on you which will take up space in your bag. Is that a good payoff? I don't know. Now we can make pipe bombs. I do need to make more of those because I used them up in the second part of the Horde Night, which you guys sadly didn't get to see. Um, but next Horde Night, I'm going to record through the night and I will just cut bits until we get some more action so we don't miss a thing. It was actually a lot better than what the video was, which is a shame because I wanted you to see it. But... We can't help these things. We live and we learn. I thought that was the end of it. What's this? A full grip. Okay, that's a mod for our weapon. Bit of paper. What we got now? Robotic, robotic turret shells. Turn that robotic turret into a makeshift shotgun. Cool. That's good. Let's read it. And did I get that paper? No, let's get it now. Anywhere else? Did I look all around there? Yeah, I did. Yeah, oh no. Shelf. Paper. I've leveled up. Amazing. All mining. I love something to do with mining. Craft diamond tipped blade mods. That dramatically increases durability. Let's use that. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. There's one. And there's some on the table here. Remember, if they disappear, then obviously they... They're not there anymore. We can't, we've, we've already been there. Paper for days, though. Paper for days! Okay. Staff room. We get a nagging Nancy in here. Anyone going to drop from the ceilings? Probably. Wrap you. Coffee. Give me coffee. And water, I will grab you and take the water, of course. Right, easy does it, guys, easy. Oh, look, there's a whole back room here, but you know it's going to be dodgy. I just, I just don't know. Hello? Oh, we have a bob. We have a bob. Come on, Em. Let's take you out. Oh, another head, man. That is 
I'm popping heads today, aren't I? Right, let's go up into this room. It's locked, but we can get in that, can't we? With a pickaxe. We have one of those on us. Let's do it. Alright. Probably get paper in this. Oh, and a book. Look at that. Doorknobs. Did you know that many doorknobs or parts like hinges are made of brass? Bullet casings are made from brass. Well, really? Learn how to harvest brass from doors and never run out of bullets again. Ah! From, from doors. Awesome. Love that. Love that. There's a safe. I'm not going to bother with the safe because it takes four Evs. Oh, there's some brass, so let's scrap it. Well, I'll tell you what, though. You know what? I'm going to smash into this safe. Why not? Okay, we're in. Oh. Well, you know, that's pretty good. We could put that on our club if we wanted to. It will light up our club and it will set them on fire. So it's kind of cool. But right now, we do need to get on with it. Because there isn't long before they're running. And without a mining helmet, I can't see very well in the dark. Oh, don't do that to me. Let's shift a little bit. Let's bring some of that home. I mean, there's some pee-pee water there. Why not? We can just boil it up. Any more pee-pee water? Saves me going to the swimming pool. Yep. Oh, an ammo stash. Nice. Check the trash can. A bit more brass. I do take that along with me. Right, so I... Well, let me know if there's anything else that I've missed, but I'm pretty sure I've raided the lot, really, haven't I? Yes. Looking good, looking good. Right, let's get on my bike. And let's get back to base. Right, where is where's my map? Where am I? Got to head downwards. Oh, I don't get caught. This isn't the time to be getting caught, man. I'm pretty low on the food situation as well. So hopefully, you know, I come across a deer pretty time soon. I mean, look, there's a there's a bear place there. So maybe we could hit that up sometime. Oh, and a farm is definitely on the agenda. We've got to get ourselves... And the doggos in there. Yeah. I don't like dogs. We know I don't like dogs. Dogs are scary. Oh, that car. Can I search that car? No, I've already looked at that car. No, 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 no. Shh. Rabbit. You seen me? You see me? He's long gone. He's long gone. Oh, there he is. He is long gone. He isn't long gone, is he? Oh, come on, I had him. Come here, come here, come here. There you are. Stay right there. Yes! God, I'm robbing bloody here, don't I? But where is it? Where's the dead bunny? You see him? There he is. Ooh, that was good, wasn't it? Nice little shot. Oh yeah, so you saw that I could track those animals. So I, I did pop a point, because I'm getting desperate for food here. I popped a point into um, Animal Tracker, which is here. And that just allows me to mark the animals on the compass and the map. Uh, so there we go. That's pretty cool. If I do it a bit more, I could get wolves and and a deer and stuff and and here we'll find uh become the ultimate tracker your senses are unparalleled you can detect predators like mountain lions or bears yeah pretty cool we have got a point to put on but i'll do that back at base all right let's carry on so i'm pretty close to base now i'll go back and sort my bags out then we'll have a chat okay so we're back at base and I want to put some of these mods on here so let's have a look so that will go on to here I presume let's have a look modify oh I've already got 
all the mods I need. Structural brace. I could swap it for that, I guess. Yeah, why not? And then we could put that on maybe this. Modify. Yeah. Um. So, go to the character. We want to put this Vandoila. Vandalia? Yeah, Vandalia mod on. Vandalia. What do we want to put it on, though? I think... we go. That one? Yeah. Alright, so that's going to help a lot. It's going to make us reload quite a lot quicker. Um, what else do we have here? Everything seems pretty good. I did have a bit of food. I've managed... We have got a bit of meat there. We do have this sham chowder, which I'm going to use, actually, because that's going to get our health up a bit there. So, in the next episode... I do want to get the cage fixed up on my base and I also want to make a farm. So day nine, guys, is a make the farm day, I think. I'm going to work through the night off camera because there's no point you just watching me bang on rocks with a pickaxe because I'm going to go down into our bunker over there and carry on building into our base underneath it. Wow, look what we have here. Just as I'm about to end the episode, there is a bear right there. Do we take it out? Oh, you know we do. Right, so he's going to tear me up, but let's do it. Here he comes. You have got meat that I need, matey. Can you come around here? Maybe to this door so I can shoot you a bit better. Where are you? Come on, here he comes up. Yeah, boys! Oh, he's fat, isn't he? Look at him, he's got to have some meat on him. No, don't go in there. I'm just going to use this blunderbuss ammo up. Yeah, I saw blood come out. I got ya, I got ya. I'm nice and safe here, but this is like... I reckon the god sent this guy to me, because... There I am going on about meat. And what wonders in, just as I'm about to do the outro? A massive bear. Mate, if I was down there, I'd be dead in seconds. I've got so much blunderbuss ammo, especially in crates. That we might as well plow it into it. Use as much of it as we want, really. I've got so much paper, it's easy to make. Come on, come a bit more into, into view so I can shoot ya. But I tell you what, they take a beating. They are... they're solid. They will take quite a few shots to take this thing down. But he's getting into my building though. I don't know if I like that. Let's just get some headshots in there. He didn't like the headshots, did he? Yeah, go for that door. Way too, way too. Yes! Right, let's see how much meat we get from this bad boy. Now remember, they are running the zombies, so... You have to be quiet. You don't want to wake them. Shh. Not like the blunderbuss was loud or anything. Oh no, he's, he's on my bike. Rushed it. Bet you have got buckled tyres. I have to send that bike to my good friend, Dazza. It's bike workshop to sort that out. Here, have that up and running in no time. Let's see. We got 17 meat. 18. 20. 21. Oh, it's. I'm loving it. Loving it. This is great. Oh, it just keeps going. 50 meat. We have a buyer. 50 meat, guys. There we go sold well anyway guys that's that for that episode i hope you enjoyed it and if you did please give it a like and i'll see you guys in the next one but bye for now